you know, I love my KS18L, but for those long rides, I would love to have a seat. So I went to eBay, I purchased this yoga foam, and I decided to cut it up a little bit and make it fit right on top uh, within the dimensions that I preferred. And it came out okay. I put a little notch there for the handle of the KS18L. The salt part is from the stock foam from the King Song, wrapped around some duct tape. I made a seat for my KS18L. This comes from a yoga tube. It was originally 12 by 6 inch tube. It's stiff but it's very light, so I cut it up rectangularly. And the dimension of this is nine inch by three and a half inch by six inch in height. And I'm gonna cut so it'll fit right in there with the handle, it goes right in. I think one addition, I, have, I should put Velcro to make it more secure, but it is relatively stiff. We'll go for a test ride, see how it's like. This is my new wheel that I made. I new seat. I made a new seat. I don't know if I can do it. I think you need to find a way to strap it on. Yeah. Otherwise it's going to fall off. I'll Velcro it. Too tall. You're too tall. Sitting at this angle. Oh, That's okay. Okay, go. Taking a bathroom break. Now, it works for women, but it doesn't quite work for men. So the seated riding is very new to me. Uh, with this DIY seat on top of my KS18L, the total height is 27 inches. I know the KS18S height itself without the seat is 28 inches, and people ride that very comfortably. With my shoes, I am 5 feet 11 inches, and it somehow feels awkward. Maybe I just need to practice more. I think eventually, with enough practice and just a little more modification, I can just ride like the other people with their KS18S seat. Thanks for watching.